Hey there, welcome to SIPS protocol analysis using Wireshark. In this video, we will see how to analyze SIP protocols using Wireshark. So if you have already have packet capture of SIP protocol or an RTP protocol, the first step what you will do to display only SIP filters, we will use help of filters like what protocol we are interested in. So in this case we are going to have only SIP and RTP protocol. Okay. So next all SIP protocol will decode as using SIP plugin. So after applying this process, now we will start the protocol analysis. So I have a figure where it's a registration process where one soft phone is trying to register itself with the SIP server. So in this process, it sends the register packet. If there is any other authorized, then 401 will come. Then again it will try to register. Finally it will get 200 OK. F4. So you can see like the packet, the first packet having a register message. It's source destination in this and trying to register with the destination of 105-105. Okay. So second is trying. Third one is got the 200 OK. Again, we have the same sequence register 100 and 200. Okay, okay. If you are interested in what the actual data is there, in this case, we can see the session initiated protocol. What is the message header? Caller sequence is register. This is the SIP server contact and other parameters of the SIP. Okay, so we can view the entire data here. What is your SIP? So, in next case, we will see what is the process of successful session establishment suppose user 1 is trying to contact user 2 so what it will do so this is after the registration process so it will send the invite invite then the start ringing process will send finally it will say 200 ok then and everything goes on then both way RTP media will be transferred and when call is disconnected, a buy message will be thrown on. Finally, a successful buy will come. So we will see this entire process in the Wireshark. So we will see the invite. Okay, invite is gone from this source destination to this. So in second step is trying then it finally got a decline here again it has been trying invite so it keep trying okay invite trying again invite okay now it started ringing so from ringing you can see this the source and destination is changed okay like here ringing user 2 to user 1 okay so after ringing ringing is passed then there is a RTP data started both way RTP media is started and finally when call is end a final buy will be there 
these are the RTP data. So for RTP data also we have to do decode as RTP plugin. Okay, and if you want to see the entire RTP session, you can see the real-time transport protocol. What exactly the messages? What is the payload? Synchronization sequence number. The entire data is getting transferred between user one and user two. So there's a. So this is the voice data getting transferred. So if you want to call back, if you want to replay, what is the voice? has been gone from user 1 to user 2 you can take help of telephony okay you can see what is the VoIP call so you can see there's two VoIP calls are here rejected you can also play okay let's say you want to play this VoIP call click on player okay click on decode so the entire message is decoded and finally select this and you can play the voice call whatever has been gone to the traffic okay thanks for watching the video hope you enjoyed the session and don't forget to view other wireshark feature in this channel and please subscribe to the channel thank you